Today we're going to work on understanding rate language in the context of a ratio relationship. An important word to know is ratio. Ratio means a comparative value of two or more amounts. If we had four bananas to two monkeys, the ratio would be four to two. Another word to know is unit rate. Unit rate is a comparison of two measurements in which one of the terms has a value of one. For example, we could look at the cost of one night stay at a hotel. Now that we understand some of the language, let's try to solve a problem. Maria hosted a party at the Krusty Krab. She ordered 20 Krabby Patties for $100. Use the unit rate to determine the cost per Krabby Patty. Some of the key words here are 20 Krabby Patties cost $100, and we're looking to find out the unit rate per Krabby Patty. To solve this, we will divide the cost by the Krabby Patties. We know that we spent $100 on 20 Krabby Patties, so we will divide 100 by 20. We divide 20 from both the top and the bottom, and we get an equivalent fraction of 5 over 1, making our unit rate $5 per 1 Krabby Patty. Let's try another. Feel free to press pause to try this on your own, or continue on with the video. In 25 minutes, Lake can run 10 laps around the track. Use the unit rate to determine the number of laps she can run per minute. The important information here is she can run 10 laps in 25 minutes, and we are looking for a per minute unit rate. We're going to solve this by dividing laps over the amount of minutes used to complete them. She completed 10 laps in 25 minutes. We're going to divide 25 from the top and bottom to get an equivalent fraction of 0.4 over 1, with a unit rate of 0.4 laps per minute. Now it's your turn to try some on your own. Feel free to go to the IXL web addresses that are listed here, or click on the link below the video to practice some more. Thanks for watching.